Hey, what's going on guys? This is Ryan with Living With XXY. This is my first YouTube post and I'm pretty excited about it. Um, so basically what this channel is about is my life and living with Klinefelter Syndrome, which is also known as 47XXY. Uh, you're probably wondering what Klinefelter Syndrome is and basically what it is is I was born with two X chromosomes and one Y chromosome. Um, so this is kind of like living proof of that you can be successful, you can live a positive life, you won't let what you're diagnosed with when you're long, younger hold you back or tell you who you are or actually defy who you are. Um, I've never let it defy me and I never will. Yes, we have side effects. Um, some of those side effects include being sterile, unable to have kids. Uh, we have tons of learning disabilities, but you just gotta work harder at it. Uh, I've, I've struggled from spelling reading, writing, pretty much anything audio, that uh, taking notes in class when I was a kid. Um, and I still struggle with spelling, reading, writing a lot. Um, another kind of thing that we have to do is we all have to take some type of testosterone, whether it be injecting ourselves with a needle. Um, I actually inject myself with a needle. I do it every seven days. Um, some people take something called Androgel, which is a rub-on cream that they rub on their body every day. Um, some other basic side effects are we kind of carry all of our weight in our stomach and our hips. We have, lot, uh, we have large hips. Um, for being 6'4", I wear a size 36, but I don't see that that's any different than anybody else. I mean, some of my guy friends have a little bit smaller waist, 34, 32. Um, so other than that, those are kind of like the negative connotations. As far as all the positive stuff goes, oh, there's so much, which I'm so thankful for. And I wouldn't want to live life any other way. Um, so basically, I'm right-brained. And I've taken a liking to cooking and photography as my two professions. Um, we also have a really good visual memory. Super hands-on, so when I was a kid playing with Legos, and all that hands-on building, kinetic, all that stuff was amazing. And I have so much fun doing it even to this day. Um, we're tall and super caring for lots of people. So guys, just a little definition of what Kleinfelder syndrome is to me. I'll definitely be doing some more in-depth talking um, on my channel. Feel free to subscribe, follow me, do all that stuff that everybody tells you to do on YouTube. And thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Talk to you soon.